Hey everyone, it's Sanya with Two Bright Saves, and I'm bringing to you guys this deal for a more intermediate to advanced couponer. There are a couple digital coupons that you will need to add, so make sure you go ahead and add them right now. And I plan on using the Spend 40, get 12% off. So of course, make sure that coupon is loaded. The first thing that you want to pick up are two of these Garnier Fructis hair masks. They are buy one get one 50% off this week. So that means the first one's going to be $4.49 and the second one's going to be $2.24. Then we have a $1 coupon on page 20 of the IBC coupon booklet. That's going to deduct a dollar off of each one. And we have a $3 off two coupon in the Retail Me Not 8 six and there's also a three dollar off to digital the next thing you want to pick up are four of the Garnier whole blends you can see that they're two for seven and we have a one dollar coupon in the IBC coupon booklet that is going to take off a dollar off of each one it's on page 20 then we have a four dollar off to digital and a four dollar off to paper coupon with this particular paper coupon is that you can only use one per transaction so that's why we're using one paper coupon and one digital so that we won't have a problem at checkout the next thing you want to pick up are two of the L'Oreal L5. You can see that they're on sale this week, two for $8. And we have a $2 coupon in the IBC coupon booklet on page 20. That's going to deduct $2 off of two. And we also have a digital coupon. At least I have one that takes off $4 off of two. You might have one that takes off $3 off of two. I'm not sure. But if you want to use the insert coupon, it's right here. And it's in the Retail Me Not 86, and it will take $3 off. Of two. The next deal that we're going to do is on the Colgate. So this week when you buy one of them at $4.99, you're going to get a $3 register reward. And there is a $1 digital. Now, I actually have a coupon on my account that's $4 off of two. So I'm going to pick up two of the Colgate and then I'm going to get the $3 register reward. Even though I'm picking up two of them, I can only get one register reward per transaction for each deal that I'm doing. So even though I'm buying two, I will not get two $3 register rewards. If you only get one of the Colgate, you may need to do the Crest deal in addition to that with this deal so that you can reach the $40 mark. And the deal with the Crest is you're gonna buy two at $2.99. There's a $2 digital. And when you buy two, you're gonna get a $4 register reward. The next item we're gonna pick up is a Tide Simply. They're on sale this week for $2.99. And when you buy three of the participating products, you get a $3 register reward back. So that is the Downy. That's a part of the participating items. The Tide Liquid and also the bounce. And even though this is a part of the PNG, because they're only $2.99, you cannot use these items for that fall rebate, the $10 fall rebate that we were submitting for last week. You can't do that. One really interesting thing that was confirmed by, I think her name is My Own Identity here on YouTube, is that these $3 register rewards are rolling. So after we do this transaction and we get the $3 register reward, we can pick up another set of those if we have the coupons and the digitals and we'll be able to use the $3 register reward to pay and then get it back. So that's a really good thing to know is that they're rolling this week, which is going to be pretty good for those of you who like to roll your register rewards. We also need to pick up one of the Tide Simply Liquid. We have a 50 cent digital and also there is a 50 cent coupon in the Retail Me Not 8 6. The last thing that we want to add for this deal is three sets of soda. As you can see right here, they're three for $2.99, but you want to be strategic in the ones that you pick up because certain ones are on Ibotta and they're giving back 25 cents. Now, if you're new to Ibotta, it's a rebate app where you can submit your receipts to get money back. And if you're new, you can use this code right here to join my team and get started. So you could pick up the A&W, that's a part of it. Sunkiss right here, this is a part of it. Canada Dry is a part of it, but not this kind. The, the ones that are included are these ones right here. And I don't even think you can do diet, but you can always check on the app by scanning the barcode and you'll know if it qualifies. So this Canada Dry will work. And then 7-Up, make sure you get 7-Up and not the one that's the diet. So those are the ones that are included. And when you get three individual ones, you're actually gonna get an extra 25 cent bonus. So that 
means you're going to get a dollar back for buying them. So you buy it three for $2.99, then get a dollar back from Ibotta. So that makes for a really good deal for these sodas. These are all the items for this deal. The total for everything is $48.67. So the first thing we want to make sure we do is to subtract $8 for all of the IVC coupons. So that's going to leave us with a total of $40.67. The IVC coupons do not count towards the spend 40 to get the 20% off. So now that we are at $40.67, the 20% will apply, which is going to deduct $8.13. Then we're going to be left with a balance of $30. $32.54. At this point, all of our digital and paper coupons will apply. That's $23.50, leaving us with an out of pocket of $9.04 plus tax. Then you should get back a $3 registry reward for the Tide products, a $3 registry reward for the Colgate, and a $1 rebate back on Ibotta, $0.25 cents for each one plus the $0.25 cent bonus. So all in all, your final total will be $1.04 for 16 items or just $0.07 cents each. At checkout, one of my $4 coupons did not come off, so I was below the amount that I needed to use 20,000 points. So what I did was I added some of the Renews It's and also a Snickers candy, and it brought my total up to $20.19. And of course, if you have points, go ahead and use them. So I used $20 in points, which is 20,000 points, and only paid 19 cents out of pocket, which I was very happy for. And of course, because my coupon didn't work, I called Walgreens to get the points back for the value of the coupon. I just finished at checkout, and as you can see, I got my two $3 registry rewards, so that was awesome. I cannot say that this transaction went flawlessly. I just can't. It didn't go so well. So let's go ahead and look at the receipt because I had to add a couple different things. And the reason why I had to add them is because some of my digital coupons did not come off and I didn't use any registry rewards. So I honestly don't know why they didn't come off, but I'm just going to call Walgreens and have them reimburse me with points. So what I did was I actually added a bunch of other things so that my total will get to over $20 so that I can use 20,000 points. And then, like I said, Walgreens will give me the points for the missed coupons. So let's go ahead and look at the receipt. The Garnier Fructis rang up just like it was supposed to, so did the Canada Dry. I had to add the Renews It, and those are 89 cents this week, and when you buy four, you get um, 89 cents off. The Tide Simply and the Pods rang up just like it was supposed to, which is the liquid and the pods, my bad. Then I had to add a Snickers um, to get to that $20, so I could use 20,000 points. And you can see the L'Oreal L5 rang up just like it was supposed to, and so did all four of the whole blends. Those rang up like they were supposed to as well. Then you can see here that my Colgate rang up and I also got $2 off for the 20%. You can see that because I had to add extra items, my 20% is $9.41. And you can see right here that all of the coupons that came off. But there are a few coupons that were missing and I've been looking at the receipt, looking at the app, and I can't figure out all of the ones that didn't come off. I know for sure one of the whole blends didn't apply but I can't figure out what else. So you can see that my subtotal ended up being $17.12. And then, let me get my receipt together. So then with tax, it's $20.19, and I used 20,000 points to pay, leaving with only having to pay 19 cents out of pocket. And then, at the end of the transaction, I hit beauty, so I ended up getting 5,000 points back, which is a huge surprise. So I will be calling Walgreens about the coupons that were missed. I'm still trying to figure out which ones they were, and once I figure out exactly which ones were missing, because my total was supposed to be $9.04, so there's some serious issues going on with these coupons. So once I figure out what happened with the coupons, then I'll call Walgreens, and they'll give me the points back so that the 20000 that I use won't be 20000 It'll be less than that. And um, yeah, so hopefully everything works out. And between me and them, we can figure out which coupons did not work.